You've got cruise questions and we have the answers. Coming up on Talking Cruise. Hi, I'm Chris Cardona. I love to answer people's questions about cruising and I invite you to post questions for any of our videos. Check out the Q&A section at TalkingCruise.com where you can post questions at any time. We'll pick some of the best questions every week and I'll answer them on a future show. While the availability of balcony staterooms on cruise ships has increased significantly over the past decade, not all balcony types and locations are created equal. On most of today's ships, you will find that the majority of accommodations include balconies. Standard balconies can be located either forward, midship, or aft, and typically have enough space for two chairs and a small table. Hump balconies are located on ships where part of the hull extends outwards. The advantages to hump balconies is that they are usually larger and in some cases offer enough space for a lounger. Aft balconies are those that offer a view of the ship's wake. In addition to the amazing view, they may also be larger and can sometimes offer an exposed section for those that like more sun. Wraparound balconies are found on the forward and aft port and starboard sides of the ship. Their advantage is typically their size being some of the largest balconies available. They also offer the unique advantage of views both forward or aft and from the side of the ship. If you're interested in any of these unique balconies, be prepared to book early as they get snagged up sometimes a year or two in advance. Thanks for watching. We'll be back next week with more answers to your cruise questions. Don't forget to like this video, post your comments and questions, and subscribe for more Talking Cruise.